I knew that very early in life that uh, there was something incredibly special about this country. When I was a child, during baseball games, the, one of the most emotional parts of that was uh, the national anthem. And I always tried to hide my tears from my brothers because I knew that many men died for that freedom to be able to have a hot dog and, and watch a baseball game. And when you see that flag waving, it resonated in me. And I knew that I had to be there. I had to, to participate in this. So I knew that when I turned 18 that I was going to join the military. Well, Oscar Rodriguez is a decorated 33-year Air Force veteran and a retiree now. And uh, he has a history of giving very stirring and moving flag-folding speeches at military events and civic events throughout the community. One of the individuals that uh, came up to me and shook my hands, he was going to retire. He says, Sergeant Rodriguez, I've, I've heard that speech on CDs. I, I heard it in person a long time ago. It would just be wonderful if you could do that for, for my family. And, and I looked at him and I said, absolutely. As a private citizen and an Air Force veteran, Oscar has the right under the First Amendment to engage in speech, including religious speech. To have my fellow family throw me out of the ceremony because of the mention of God is beyond me. When Master Sergeant Roberson's commanding officer found out that Oscar was going to be performing this flag folding speech that was going to mention the word God, he took steps to have Oscar banned from the ceremony, and when he found out that he didn't have the legal authority to ban Oscar, a private citizen, from this ceremony, he then had members of his command in uniform show up to remove Oscar. I stood up, went to my position, faced the audience, and this individual comes up to me, and he says, you're not going to do this, are you? And I'm thinking, so what is he talking about, that I'm really going to do what? Mention God? Yeah, I'm really going to do that. As soon as I hear my cue, I start with my speech. And they grab me, and they pull me, they assault me as the flag is open, because I dare to mention God. The tragic irony here is that flag folding speech talks about the fact that the United States flag stands for freedom of speech, freedom of religion, freedom of conscience. And it was those very words that resulted in Oscar being assaulted and forcibly dragged away by men wearing the uniform of the United States Air Force, men who are sworn to protect people like Oscar and their right to engage in that very speech. Our military service members make huge sacrifices to defend our freedoms every day. We're committed to defending the religious freedom of every U.S. military man, woman, and veteran, just like Oscar. It is this one nation under God that we call with honor, the United States of America. God bless our flag. God bless our troops. God bless America.